Hey guys, how's it going? I'm here back with another fun little Warno video. I got Electronic versus a very good player, uh, a Wooden, who I've had the pleasure of playing with and known for quite a bit now in the Warno world. Uh, looks like Electronic is doing a, a good old Healy push, as you can see here. Look how epic that looks. All the helicopters. Uh, he is going to be playing as the 3rd, and then we have uh, Wooden playing as the 39th. I believe he's playing as the 3rd, I could be wrong, um, but I'm pretty sure. And I don't know if Wooden has seized these guys yet, but uh, holy moly, he's about to. And it doesn't look like Wooden has any AA, and the only AA he's moving is actually on the other side. So all of a sudden he's like, uh-oh, and you can see <laughs> he's grabbing his AA over here. And right now, the Apaches are flying in. Now I know this is like um, a meta or something like that, and it looks like, oh wow, he, so he's counter a his SU, wow, and takes that out. And now the other AA is coming in here, so he did this Healy Rush, and then now he's uh, helping it out with these two AAs, and they actually sent in the Cobras to take out that one uh, anti-air. So Wooden went for an infantry route up the middle, and essentially what he's doing now is just Healy rushing and attacking him uh, with the helicopters, basically just trying to completely stop any type of movement, and honestly, it looks like it's working. Uh, that looks incredibly frustrating, <laughs> but he still hasn't gotten any command or anything like that, so will this actually be useful? Um, we don't know yet. It looks like he hasn't even ordered anybody over here, um, so he's just kind of kind of waiting um you know i don't know the total rules of like what the thing is but man look at those models beautiful very loud sorry about that and so as a he's just kind of flying his plane trying to keep an eye on everything but a wooden has a free chance of just really getting a foothold but the downside is he doesn't have a chance to stop these helicopters so if he uh, you know just keeps if he knows where he's at, he could just fly these guys and then uh, try and take out these uh, other areas where they can't really defend themselves. I don't even know if that AT could really uh, do anything uh, powerful, but I mean, his helicopters are getting low, and he probably used a, quite a lot of them. But I mean, this is kind of like how I've done some stuff in the past, but I didn't do it with helicopters. I would do it with, uh, I think it was the the 7th or the 4th. They had like super cheap tanks, obviously, great commentary, Matt. They have super cheap tanks, and then, oh gosh, he's just camping it. Oh, that's horrible. Is that the only place where his reinforcements will go out of? That is kind of, that is kind of cheeky. And quite uh, unfortunate, because now his, his guys literally can't do anything. But he is sending in some AA helicopters, but even then, oh my gosh. Wow. This has to be probably the most toxic thing I've ever seen. Goodness gracious. Does he even want to win, or is he just trying to watch the world burn? Well, uh, over here, he can just kind of dr keep driving his BTR dude and just grab all this, and all this stuff, and there's nothing he can do about it. He is sending two helicopters this way, but... I wonder if these BMPs can do everything, but yeah, right now he is literally, and they need to fix this in this game. You should be able to have other areas, but yeah, he's just camping where the land and everything comes out of. He doesn't have anything he can do to get reinforcements, but eventually you will think that some of those helicopters will go down and oh my gosh, he's going to lose his command. This is literally just him sending in helicopters and just holding it right there. Wow. That is a... Uh, that is quite um, quite unfortunate and uh, how this is happening. And I don't even uh, know what... <laughs> Hope they run out of fuel, I guess. I mean, eventually they'll run out of ammo, right? Um, they s still got... Okay. Man, this is um, not what I was expecting whenever I turned on this game, that's for sure. Did not see this one coming. And hopefully, I, I know this has been a, a, a meta for a while now, just doing Healy Rushes. Look at how pretty the water is, though. Now I'm just looking at the environment. But man, like you gotta say, though, this game does have pretty pretty graphics. You know, not some areas not amazing, but the environment and everything, very impressive. 
So I mean, if I was a weirdo, and I'm not really sure how I'd go about this, I would just try and um, fly my planes out, I guess, um, and then just hope that I could take out some of his helicopters that are just camping this area, like what he's doing right here. And then instantly he's going to call in his anti-air plane. And so there's just not really anything he can do about it. Um, he's just going to have to hope that he can get some off, maybe, you know, cause that to happen. And nope, nothing. He's trying to ill. He, he got one helicopter. And that is something. I mean, a Wooden is still in the lead. So he's got that going for him. He did just take out one of the planes. So there's uh, an HE just took out an anti air. So that's kind of funny. This is a very interesting battle. I never really expected this <laughs> to be a thing. And I, that's that's going to be an interesting little dogfight. But what if, uh, you know, Wooden, hopefully his. His plane is just trying to get one little shot off before he gets hit, but is he going to get... Ah! Oh. I am totally cheering against Electronic right now. This has got to be one of the most like toxic ways you can uh, go about this, but if you don't defend against it, which how can you when it's that many? But it was so unfortunate because he didn't a lot, a lot of AA. Um, that's why every single time, because I used to get like freaking PTSD whenever this stuff would happen, I would always, always have at least like four or five things of AA, so this kind of stuff wouldn't happen to me. But yeah, I mean, he's about to just, he's sitting in a BTR, he's trying to get out right away, and he's dead. Goodness gracious, how would you go about this? Your AAs are just going to get shot instantly. I mean, what I would do is I would just call in the cheapest possible units, a ton of them, make them waste their ammo. I mean, that's pretty much what I would do. I'd be like, all right, military police, 15, go, and then just have them shoot them up. Hopefully they run out of ammo. Then after that happens while they're distracted, you know, that's probably what he's doing. He's like, fine, I'll just call on these cheap dudes, and you can just, my gosh, it's absolutely deleted. It's ridiculous. Well, for him to get in the lead, and I mean, and Awudin knows this, he does have this under wraps. He has these uh, things, so for the only way for him to get in the lead is what he's doing right here, which is smart. He's going to go around and fly over to Alpha, and that's going to give him a plus one uh, positive. I mean, it's if you can pull this off, it's I guess it's technically your fault for not having any anti-air, and you should have had that ready to go. But still, he I mean, I guess when he dies, he can't see that this is still ongoing. It's just him flying. But for me, that's crazy that there's only one entrance point. Doesn't that seem wild that you only have that? Especially, but I guess that's the balance because this isn't yours anymore. But what they should do is like, okay, so if you own this, right, you own this, there is a there is a road right here. Why couldn't they drive around and go over here? Same with Bravo. Why couldn't he do that? Change where your reinforcements can come in based off what you own, which actually gives you more advantages because, you know, yeah, you can take the center, but... I don't know, and like maybe it's a balancing act too. Yeah, he's just trying to do anything he can. I don't think he's going to be able to get past this. I think he's screwed now. Most anti, most anticlimactic game I've seen in a while. Now this is realism. Well, that's something that he's definitely uh, gonna, you know, take, uh, take home and learn. It's a shame because the is such a good player. So I was always, I was pretty excited to see what. He would try and do, and now, yeah, his helicopter's just kind of flying wherever he wants. He's like, okay, I'll fly here now and drop that off. I mean, it's it's not a bad it's not a bad strat, funnily enough. I don't know how viable it is now. Um, once again, you know, I'm I'm kind of getting back into the game, so I you know I could be out of the, you know, there could be some meta that I'm that I'm missing, or not understanding potentially, but. This one's pretty pretty insane. His motor strike are just kind of hiding in here. They're just he's just putting them at all points of where they could be found. Looks like he's sending in an A10 to see if he can get any type of uh, strafing run. Basically, probably because he saw something on uh, recon and he's gonna drop it off. But let's get a good look at this one. Ah, flew away. Pretty cool. Oh yeah, nice. Uh, look, look, he's just he's just putting look at this. All right, let's see what happens here. This this could be interesting. Go out 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 get out get out get out shoot shoot. 
Take him out. Come on. Come on. Do something. Come Oh my gosh. Igla's. Oh, man. I have never cheered harder against somebody. This may be the most toxic thing I've ever seen. Um, like, he's just, yeah, I mean, he's just gonna, that's just exploiting how the game works. I mean, I guess that's something you have to worry about when you do 1v1s. Because when you do a 1v1, this is what could happen. So to prepare for that, you kind of, you don't have to always make sure that you are well diversified. And if you really, 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 um, go ham on a certain strat, well, you have to be prepared for that to be exploited, which is what happened here. And now, I mean, there's nothing he can do. Unless, like, something amazing happens, but, I mean, he's sending another helicopter in here. How much are these? <laughs> I mean, this is insane. Just chilling. Look at the water, though. The water looks nice. Even got a little reflection. Might as well look at the model while we can. Wow. So loud. Oh, look at this. Look at all these planes coming through now. Gosh, even the helicopters are taking out his planes. Okay, he took out one helicopter. But now for a wound and a catch up, I mean, he one, he has to take out all of these helicopters that are also anti-air helicopters. And now he has an anti-air plane coming towards him who is going to take out that. Yeah, he took that one out. Oh, my sweet lord. Look at this, dude. Oh my gosh, this is like an air, this is a straight up air battle. I mean, that's, that was kind of cool. Now he's going to be in the lead soon, I think. I mean, I would give up. I'd be like, this is, well, at this point, you know, is what it is, right? This plane's about to run out of fuel. Will it just, like, crash? <laughs> yeah, he's at plus 11 right now. I mean, that's not a bad way to do it. Fly your uh, command helicopter, land, leave, land, leave, land, leave. I mean, if there's no AA, he has no AA now. They all got destroyed. So is this plane just kind of like, well, they just like auto evac out here. I'm just curious now. I've never noticed that before. Is he going to crash? He's out of fuel. He has no fuel. Probably just force leave, yeah, which makes sense. It'd be funny if it just like slowly went down and hit the ground, crash landed. Oh, it did. It straight. <laughs> Man, I missed that. Dang it. It just disappeared. Huh. I didn't see anything. Maybe it fell in the water. Well, that's unfortunate. Jeez. Well, I mean, at this point, <laughs> I'd be so mad. I would be pissed. Well, those guys just disappeared too. Well, if you run out of fuel, do do you lose them? Wonder. Misa, wonder. And look, oh, hey, he's like, hey, you guys need more helicopters? Because I got them. And now he is shooting at that BMP. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, this guy's out of fuel. He's got to be, right? Oh, I know. Not yet. Survive, BMP. He's just not even doing anything. I think he's just like, yeah, I'm just going to let this time go out. There's no point anymore. Oh my gosh, and he's bringing supply. Okay, okay, let's see how this goes. This is going to be a bloody, bloody bath. Get out, run. Yeah. Oh, dead. Sweet mother of God. Sweet mother of God. Why? Why? Wow. Look at this. Jeez. Uh, I mean, yeah, I think that was just him, like, doing, like, any type of hope. But with this plus 11, there's just... There ain't nothing you can do. He's like, oh yeah, let me put a supply here just for good measure. Gosh. That was ridiculous. Who'd even lose? Yeah, so um, 
Didn't see that one coming. Um, really wasn't sure how that was going to go. Uh, wow. So he got some, he literally got a few kills with his HE. One kill with the anterior, the one anterior he had. And then like, oh, oh, really? I'm surprised. Really? Really? It's Cobras? Yeah, so that was probably the most toxic game I've ever seen. So I'm going to go take a shower after that. Hope I, I don't even think, I hope you guys didn't enjoy this. If you enjoyed this video, you have a problem and you need help because, wow, just, um, wow. Wow, wow, wow.